This is the newly modified basement. Oh, it's nice. Awesome hangout place for winter. Got the uh, quadraphonic set up here. We got some lasers going on. We got Christmas lights. We got a table and stuff, and it's awesome. Alex and Brandon are coming over soon. Check this out. We got Breaking Bad. We got B Marley. B Marley. Yeah, uh huh? And an aux input. Right now we're on Magic 105.7. I can switch right over to uh, the 3.5 mil. And there we go. All right. Maybe we'll actually film something tonight since I remember to bring my camera down. Well, I failed with that. Didn't film anything. Uh, only Alex was able to come. Everybody else uh, didn't make it. So that was kind of a kill for the night. Um, anyways, we watched some Family Guy. Now, anybody know what this show is? Perhaps. It's pretty stupid. But when you're really tired at the end of the day, it's something funny to throw on. I'm drinking some of this. Alex brought this over the other night. I've never had it. It's Arizona Golden Bear Lemonade. It's pretty good. It's got strawberry in it. Um, so we got about 12 inches of snow today. I didn't film any of this this morning because I got up, supposed to be at the grandparents at nine. There was no way I could get out of the driveway. So I shoveled it or I blew the driveway off. Um, none of the roads were plowed until we got to the main roads and they had been done hours earlier. So it was really bad. Um, possibly the worst conditions I've ever driven the M5 in. And it did pretty well until I got to my grandparents driveway, which had, they had less down there. It's a few miles south probably six inches of fresh powder. There's no way I was moving in that. So I stopped the car at the end of the driveway, blew the whole driveway off with his snow blower. Um, that was able to get me about an extra six inches. So then I had to get a coal shovel out of his basement and shovel myself a path. It took forever for me to be able to get that car up the driveway. Those tires suck on untreated roads. Once you put some salt down and once it becomes sloshy, then it's drivable. Before that, it's a complete lost cause. Horrible. Anyways, got over there, we ended up, I drove the Cadillac. That's the first time I've driven a front wheel drive car in the snow. Totally different experience. It did much better than the M5 did for snow. Um, we got over to Acme, we got a bunch of groceries, we went to Bob Evans, we replaced some more light bulbs, you know, the normal stuff with them. I didn't film any of that. That was today. So I'm sorry, it's a really sucky vlog, very uneventful. I'm gonna lay down here, probably not, probably tried to not fall asleep again. I just lost my drink walking around the house here somewhere. I'm gonna watch some of that. I'm gonna go up, do the emails, do the vlogs, do the YouTube, and then I'm gonna fall asleep pretty soon at 12 o'clock. So uh, tomorrow's Sunday. Might be going out uh, with Brandon tomorrow night, get some dinner, um, see what the roads look like tomorrow. I actually washed a car today. Washed, I mean, rinsed it off from salt, took a sponge to it, and then dried it with a leaf blower. So it's not exactly clean. However, it is not salty. Did the same thing with the Honda, though I didn't go as crazy with the leaf blower because the smoke alarm was going off and that's really annoying. But uh, this looks pretty good, right? For the kind of weather outside, I'm pretty happy with that. And that new steering wheel will give you another peek. Oh yeah, I like it. It really, it really does make the car look and feel a lot more modern. Before, you know, it was pretty good, but you, you you knew you were in a 10 year old car. That honestly feels a lot like the E60 M5 wheel, just a little more rounded. Um, it's really thick and soft and it's excellent. I haven't even conditioned it yet. All right, that's it. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Sleep well, good night.